What's up, everybody? It's Steve. I'm doing the response to an anthropological introduction to YouTube. And I'm pretty much going to be focusing, this up, focusing on Michael Wesh's video just because it was longest and, you know, he had the most to say, I guess. Um, YouTube is crazy right now. It started out a dude at the zoo saying, hey, what's up? I'm at the zoo. And now you got the Numa Numa dude and, you know, Chocolate Rain guy and Chad Vader. He started on YouTube, right? Something like that. And they just become internet sensations. And lots of people get their start on YouTube. And it's crazy that people just say, oh, I'm going to take a video of you doing what you do. And we're going to put it on YouTube and you're going to become a hit. That's just it's crazy. I mean... People get millions of hits on their videos, and I don't understand how it happens. I mean, people watch it, but how does, like, the Charlie bit my finger thing? People are just drawn to it. They just want to watch it. It's so weird, and that's what I really don't understand about YouTube. I mean, sure, you can put whatever you want up there, but why would you want to put something up like something up online for the whole world to see not just you not just your friends like people in japan people in asia people in canada people in mexico people in germany britain can all see well charlie bit my finger wasn't britain or at least he sounded like it were in britain but like numa numa who's in jersey and he's just doing a dance and then it was one of the most famous internet sensations of all time so far and he's just some dude in Jersey who found a song and did basically karaoke to it or uh, lip syncing and a little dance and everybody loves it and they remix it and make it into something else and it's just insane how people just videotape themselves it's weird I, I don't like this videotaping thing just staring at this little camera and talking to myself and sitting alone in my room it's kind of uncomfortable I mean I've been behind the camera before but I've never been in front of the camera talking directly to a camera with no one else behind it no one in the room with me it's just me and this camera and I'm talking to it and I'm going to put it up on YouTube and people can see my idiot thoughts and comment on the stupid things I have to say it's just like it's so weird because 10 years ago <laughs> there was no such thing as YouTube or and people didn't think that stuff like this would happen you could, couldn't just you take a video and you would keep it to yourself or you make a tape out of it and send it to your friends and then they would make a tape of it or something and that's the only way it would go around that would slow, be slow and no one would actually get it but now you can put a five minute video of you talking in to yourself and put it on the internet and millions and billions of people can see it and it's just like why why would, why do people love YouTube so much that they just sit at home pop in their webcam and just talk about nothing or talk about something that they saw on TV like oh the football game or oh baseball do you believe that really what happened I'm going to analyze it and then people are going to comment on it it's weird and YouTube's crazy and Michael Wish man when he was talking about his first video log I, I get exactly how he's feeling talking to the camera some people can do it others people can't I'm one of those people who can't but it's definitely something that's going to take a while to get used to and Hopefully by the end of this I can become better at talking to the black circle and red square and no one, just hear my voice with no one around to laugh at my stupid voice and the stuff that I say. I don't know, I'm just rambling now. I guess that's what happens when you put this camera on, but YouTube, it's crazy. People that put up videos crazy because they let people into their private lives they make their private lives public and 
it's something not that's not for everyone. I guess I'll leave it at that. Putting yourself on YouTube, it's not what everyone should do. I should not be doing this, but I will. You know, you live with it. Not that many people are going to see it. I'm not going to become an internet sensation, especially talking about nothing. But it's different, something you got to get used to. So I'll get used to it. Don't worry.